Hello, my name is Brenton and I work at the Makery and Elmer's Public Library. Today, I'm going to show you how to convert text into vector lines using Adobe Illustrator. This is important when using equipment like our laser cutter. Our laser cutter has two different functions, raster engrave, which allows users to engrave on the surface of materials, and vector cut, which allows users to cut into material up to a quarter inch thick. Vector files are required to use vector cut on our laser cutter. Now, before I begin, I want to let you know that I'm in the Essentials Workspace tab. Please make sure to transition over to this to ensure that our screens look identical. Um, each workspace has different, um, different, different views. Things are located at different sections, but they all have the same function. So to begin, I'm going to head over to the Type tool on the left-hand side, click it, and drag out a text box. Uh, I'm going to type, I want happy. So if you notice here, um, with this font that I have, each letter is already connected. So, so each letter, so when this transforms and when we cut it on the laser cutter, it will become one solid piece. Now, if you wanted you know, each letter individually, then you'd have to find a font that has the letters separate. So I'm gonna start with this, I'm gonna highlight everything. I'm going to go over to the right hand side and click create outlines. This is going to convert everything into a path and no longer an editable text. So now you can see it has created an outline here. But something we need to note is each letter is still separate. So see how the, the H is still comes over there. So it's going to cut out all these lines. So we're still going to have the H. This is going to cut out and then that A is going to be left with kind of a, a naked spot there. So to fix that, we're going to click on it and then click this Unite button on the side. And now this is going to merge everything into one. So now we got one solid object that when we transfer it over to the laser cutter software, it'll just cut this out directly and not have any gaps in between. Now down here, I have this little hello, but if you notice in the spot, each letter is connected except this H. So for my project right now, I want I want everything to be connected to be one solid object. So in order to do this, I need to alter the kerning. The kerning is the spacing between letters. So I'm going to go and highlight the H here. And then on the right hand side, there's the kerning section. So this I'm going to bring negative, And this is going to bring the other letters closer to me. So now right here, you can see that the H is now connected with all the other letters. So I'm going to do the same thing we did before, highlight everything, click that Create Outlines button, and then click to Unite under Pathfinder, and now it is one solid object. So now I have my two, two I got happy and hello here. Second I'm going to do, is to save my file, I'm going to go up to File, Save. I'm going to name it, um, say Happy Hello. I'm going to change the file type to SVG. I'm going to click Save. This box will come up with some different options. You don't need to alter anything for this. We're going to click OK. And now your file is saved. Thank you.